Hello everyone. Hello, welcome to a new video. Yes, what do we have? We have a scooter. <laughs> we have a red beast. <laughs> the most expensive scooter in Asia, I think. Exactly so far. Guys, why is it so expensive? We told you it will be Oops. hard. We couldn't rent in uh, Putrajaya. We okay. didn't find. Then here is the only option, this one. 70 ringgit per day. Very expensive. Very, very expensive. I think in Indonesia the most we paid was like uh, ten dollars. But this happened when there's no uh, uh, competition between uh, offers, you know. So if even here we Google, we called a few of them. Nobody, uh, all of them, they said no. This was the only guy who said that he has available. So we don't know. But obviously we can tell. We told you. We understand this, but. It is what it is. At least we are happy that we, we even forgot how nice it is to have a scooter, you know, because it saves so much time, guys, time. To have a, to have a scooter and to don't have that much agglomeration like it's in... Uh, Malacca. Oh, my God. This city is so, is so free, you know? It is. It is. So don't forget, we do this especially for saving time. Time is priceless. We are just learn, teaching our friend here not to waste his time. But he was just laughing at us. Okay, so guys, I want to teach you some trick. Teach us, babe. Because we teach it as well yesterday. So no, let me go on the, the other side. You want to turn on the scooter? You cannot. And guess what? We we were a bit. Uh, we were left a bit stunned yesterday. Yeah. <laughs> what happened? How do we start the scooter? So you have this key here. Mm -hmm. This key in this key. <laughs> This one you use to unlock. Yeah. Good. And for its safety, you press this button and lock it. <laughs> and unlock, and uh, there you have. Yeah, but isn't this like a universal key, maybe? Uh, who knows? Who knows? Exactly. Probably it is. So, something else we've learned today is that we are living in a mall in a building that was supposed to be a mall, we believe, because we got, excuse me, we got lost at some point. We, we, said, we asked yesterday, what is at the M, M level? Level M. And we tried today and we, uh, we were locked there and we end up out of nowhere. And uh, then we saw escalators and all of a sudden it was like huge mall. We believe this didn't finish, you know? And we couldn't open the door back to <laughs> go back. The same door we used to get mm -hmm. in. Yeah, so yeah. then we had to find these stairs. And after 10 minutes, like, yeah, we finally managed to find yeah, a way out. So, so now we, we want you to say, babe? Yeah, I said, so there's supposed to be something. I believe, yeah, this is a mall because the escalators are looking brand new, unused. Mm. So a mall, like, uh, it wasn't finished. Exactly. Complete, you know, to be used. Exactly. And maybe... The, either they are combined, the parts of the hotel, this like Airbnb, or they converse it, you know, from a mall, since maybe there was no more interest, you know, in people developing it and nobody wanted to move here to open businesses here. So then they said, okay, let's get some money back and try to, you know, do some apartments. We don't know, but anyway, it's good. So, so okay. we've been, by the way, oh, another thing we've learned today here in this uh, city, Melaka. There's only one decent coffee, what we consider this co decent coffee shop in the city that offers like Western style of breakfast. You know, they even have uh, an English breakfast. And good uh, coffee uh, quality. Exactly. So for all of you who know b business, people interested in opening businesses, this definitely. So we got there, that coffee shop. And they said 40 minutes of waiting. Can you imagine that? For breakfast. 40 minutes to have a breakfast or a coffee. So guys, open here a coffee shop, a good, very good coffee that offer good quality food because you'll have loads of clients. They are uh, on the Google Maps, but when you arrive at them, they are closed. Uh, after the pandemic time, maybe they uh, fail. Yeah, but still none offers what they offer because that's the idea. They offer good food, you know, good food. And that's why people go there. They have good rating, also good coffee, but even more important, good food. Because then you'll have all the white clients, you know. But people like us that visit Malacca, you know, that would be the only option for us. The only... 
because we want to have our breakfast good one and after that try maybe local and exactly, see if we know, like this, uh, this We food. don't feel like eating chicken uh, every morning no. at 8 o'clock, no, chicken with rice. No. But that was our breakfast today. But it was no longer breakfast because it was at around 11 o'clock. So, so I had the wonton soup. <laughs> wonton <laughs> soup at, at 11 o'clock in the morning. Yeah. So from, uh, from what we've seen so far, this city babe, so as soon as we left civilization, we end up here. This is guys, oh my God. Parking pay uh, mafia here. Yeah, yesterday we saw uh, when we picked up our scooter, there was some guy there uh, charging money. You know, it's very cheap, it's one ringgit. You all know, told us we can drop the scooter without him being present. He told us just to pay one ringgit for the parking. But all of the sudden, all the memories, you know, Oh, what no, happens when no, there's no more Indonesia civilization? Especially. Exactly. Okay, man. And loads of old buildings that are ugly in the city. So we can tell the city it's old, but there's not an excuse for not renovating them. You know, our home city, or rather in Romania, looked exactly the same until 10, 15 years ago. When then the the city hall, the mayor obligated the people to renovate it. You know, it either and they also give them uh, credit with no interest on them. And then they just, um, either you do renovate your building or pay double or triple taxes for it, you know? So this is how they coerce them. And now it's uh, one of the most beautiful cities in the country, the city center part, True. not all of the city. So we're going now and explore to see. Exactly. What and else can we see in Malacca? Because so far, honestly, for me, from what we've seen, you know, we initially thought that two full days will not be enough, but I believe they are. I believe they are, yeah. Mm -hmm. Let's see. We made it to Famosa, 1511. Guys, there's uh, some rehearsal, obviously, for Friday, maybe, with loud music and then... Organization. Some people... Uh, Training. Doing some sort of... <laughs> rehearsal thing going on here. Can you see this uh, kind of, what was this? Wow. Made out of stones and something. Yeah. This building reminds But 1511, that's five... 500 and something, yes. And 11 years. Oh my God. Yeah. That's something. Let, let me show you guys what's happening here. So, what dance is this one? What is this for? Good. All Blacks. Which version of All Blacks? <laughs> Let's, let's enter the fortress, babe. Okay. I don't believe this. Belongs to that time. <laughs> no, this sustain the building. Mm -hmm. To don't fall. Probably. True. Let's go up. So uh, we have here a section with the Dutch graveyard. Looking. So is this still legit? Like there's people buried here? Probably. So Probably now we're the walking. big ones. Probably. Who knows? Check this out here. Yeah. Oh. What I like the most is these old trees. They're they spectacular. Give, and they give good shadows. Wow. Because this uh, we like uh, at the trees. They are so good for shadows. Exactly. They are old, big. Beautiful. So they form like a complete, you know, like tunnel. So this is something written here, guys. Why would you do this big uh, gravy? Touch. Robert Scott's Penang World died here. 
on 16th day of May 1843, age 33, age 32 years old. Hmm, oh, pretty young. How much 80 uh, years old? 32. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Such a shame. Yeah. That's why we need education, guys. Because without education, then we have problems in the world, like war, crime, all sorts. And all this is caused by the lack of education. Definitely. So please, let's all educate ourselves. Did you read today? How much did you read? <laughs> How much did you invest in your brain today? Because we promote this kind of things, reading and educating. That's why we don't do subscribers. So let, probably this will bring <laughs> more subscribers. <laughs> oh my God. Yeah, because no. people, we, we really saw this. People are not that interested. No, you know, exactly. People in this like... kind of develop, because it's hard to develop. It's really hard and they doing this uh, every single day. It's the hardest work. That's why guys, we keep telling you, that's why it's only that one percentage of whatever is now in the world of people successful. And then the rest, we just suffer. Oh exactly. my God, Cause check this out. Guys, the diameter of this tree. Babe, this is like four or five meters. This is four or five meters. In Here diameter. I see just one rubbish. If we were in Indonesia, this one were, oh, would be full God. of rubbish. Plus, guess what? This is St. Peter's Hill. That means some sort of from the Christian, you know, because this is all from the Portuguese era when uh, Christians were here, you know, colonizing. Then the British came along. So no entrance fee, no scammers trying to sell us tickets, you Thanks know. Thanks God, because we are, I mean. Yes, we had enough, we had of, enough. enough of those in our previous destinations. <laughs> so what do we, we have? We want more civilization. Oh, I don't know. Where are we going, babe? I don't know. I think Maybe not we should return. Building. Yeah, and go and up at exactly the, that door. building. Old building. This actually. is also abandoned. I don't know what this used to be, but... There are so many abandoned buildings here in this oh, city. This is the rest of the cemetery downstairs. Oh, downstairs. I'm wondering if this grass is not growing or they cut it uh, often because it's so no. well maintained, this yeah, grass. They, uh, they definitely do cut it, you know. They definitely and do it's, cut it. And you can see clearly it's maintained. Here it's not growing because of the shadow, you know, mm -hmm. most likely. And the soil is different here. But this is an old uh, cemetery. Exactly, the same uh, Dutch cemetery. I don't think, ah, we could go just uh, through that part. What's happening with all those scooters there? <laughs> oh, something is there, maybe, maybe police. Or school or, you know. So you, you uh, can see that there's also access through this alley here, back alley. So if we only knew how to get here. Oh, by the way, guys, let me show you. Let me tell you because there's something we don't like that happens in every country, ours included when there's some uh, minister or some very important person, political, obviously, they start to block the city. So we needed like 20 minutes to get here instead of the two minutes because of the one way system streets, then we end up somewhere with the road closed, closures again. Oh, guys, mm -hmm. this is, you know, abusing power. This happens only in this, I mean, almost everywhere, almost actually. Everywhere. Yeah. And we hate you, uh, one, if it's one important person. Yes, they need to block all the traffic, you know, to close streets so they can have a clear and fast, you know, way. But weren't they elected to serve you? Where are they rushing? Why are they time so priceless? And yours, yours not. And yours is not. This is the most disgusting thing I see, you know, everywhere when politicians act like this. No, dude, we are, you are elected to serve the public. So just, you know, be the be, same. Exactly, be Doesn't like as, as a member of the public. Why you always have to be privileged? And people move away, you know, for you. Oh my God, I hate them. I know, I know. 
Uh, but um, because people people accept this, obviously, usually they can do it. If people would not accept, nobody will do it. So this is like an old church. Mm -hmm. Let's start from here. Wow. Uh oh. Uh oh. These big blocks. The grave of Harbour Master Pedal. More probably Jacob's Pedal. Wow. Okay. So all these people who construct this are dead now. <laughs> what is this life? Hmm? But this was like a church fortress, like they all are, you know, because look at the thick of the walls. You so know? they were hiding in case of... Uh, exactly, in case of something. Something. Francesca Barber. Oh, this was... Jacobi uh, Barber. Writing nice. Ca Capuchin. This was an order. Jacobi. 1695. Mm. Jacobi name. Mm. Barber. So old. So old. And also this uh, floor, yeah. yeah. Obviously the floor, the... Everything. Oh, this is massive <laughs> building. Wait. Hmm? Who were they keeping here? Oh. Prisoners. Well, probably in the church? Yeah. I mean... You know how it is. We all love God, but we still have enemies. There's also Satan. Yeah? <laughs> Probably, yeah, as you say. Oh, you know, people throw money. For what? Oh, I don't. For this. La being lucky. Through this hole. <laughs> I think so. Uh -huh. For being lucky yes. to go through the prison. <laughs> Oh, how lucky I am. Let's throw some money. Oh, so this also uh, funeral stones. 50, oh, how do you uh, call 1656, this? yeah, My funeral God. stones, I think. So much history. Uh, how, how big is one wall? So definitely it's double and half than me, I think. <laughs> it's uh, one meter, one meter, 20 centimeters. Easy. But oh. these stones, who brought here these stones, baby? Because I can't believe you cannot move them. Well, just wait until you'll see the pyramids up close and then, and then you you'll will see real... Real hard work. <laughs> exactly. So wow. there's the cross on top of uh, that wall. The symbol of Christians. Mm -hmm. All right, but this, uh, this area, it's more Muslim. Religion, it right? is now, but you know, back Christian then, time. it was yeah. colonized by Portuguese, ah, so Christian, yeah. Christians. And then the British ruled here, the last empire to rule, mm -hmm. also Catholics. No, no, not Cat Catholics, Jesus, like Protestants, mm. they are the, the British. Okay, an angel with wings, a heart. So this is like, I think this is the historical city of Malaysia might be this Melaka Bay. Probably. Because you know so many old, this is the business here in Melaka. So many it, things happening here. Old, old, like old. old you come to old see buildings. history, old buildings, old churches, old everything. Prison. Mm -hmm. Obviously they explain here everything, but we are too lazy to read. So this is on the hill and you have a view. Mm -hmm. 180 or how much? And also... Guys, what do you say? Should we try that thing? That rotating 360 rotating degree. Thing. What do you say, babe? Um, do we go for it or not? If you would like to go, we I can don't, go. I Me don't. Too. I, I don't have fun on that thing. You don't have? Don't okay, why. then we don't go. Just if you want for you for fun. No, ma'am. There's no fun in that for me. No. This is so nice illuminated at night, you know, mm -hmm. St. Paul's. Mm -hmm. And it's well maintained and it's clean. It we is, see yes. at least 
I think the first country we haven't explored it all. One month and one some month. way, one yeah, month, yeah. and uh, it's quite clean here now. Great, I love it. Oh, we can go up in the or not? No, 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 we can't. Is it closed? Because it's closed there. Probably access just for uh, private. Oh yes, it's, stuff. it's got the lock on. Now everyone can be a pilot. We found our private jet. Yeah, <laughs> this this is the one. So imagine how we will fly it. <laughs> what do you say, guys? It's looking so beautiful. I oh like it. I say, oh yes. I would fly one of these old ones, you know. <laughs> Ah, you would like? Yeah, oh, I'd love to. And a small one, yeah? <laughs> Something like this, ah, exactly. Uh -huh. Something really similar to this one. Smaller, bigger, doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. matter. It's, uh, it's looking uh, nice, <laughs> definitely. And it's big enough. Because anyway, we were talking about uh, what plane we will buy in the future. I think this, uh, before COVID, you could go inside, you know? That's ah. why that's an advertisement which anyone can be a pilot and then you could go in the cockpit. Wow, that would be amazing. So Definitely. we can see there's also the train, mm -hmm. carriages, two carriages. Mm -hmm. What else is here? Also, um, this the, is the fire truck. I think so. I think so. And also it's like we are in England. Oh, with fun both. Fun both. Yeah. <laughs> All sorts of museums here, guys. This Malacca, it's a great, great piece of history. <laughs> I think this is the main reason I told you, you know, to Trump. come here. If you're passionate about history, this is your city so far from what we've seen. Mm -hmm. We love abandoned places. This is our last objective for the day. Yes, please. Oh. Uh. This is an old church, cathedral almost like. Yeah. Abandoned. Sacred Heart Chapel, babe. Good. We love yes. these abandoned places, guys. We'll try we to visit more. I think this Malacca this is, was good for this For abandoned thing. places. Yes, because also everything is old. They had a wood balcony there. So exactly. on these two uh, stones, it stays one uh, balcony with the they, woods in the... Um, this is like classic wood. Christian church, you know, design. Do you remember because Perfect. also our Orthodox, this was Catholic probably. Uh -huh. Oh, this is oh, so old. So old, so... Look how this is shaking. No, everything, it's rotten. But what's still intact, look at the windows. The windows with Those. the colors blue, the green, white, red. Those, vi how they are called in English, I don't know, vitrali in, uh, I don't know, guys, something. But this uh, painted glass, yeah, Ortho thin. Orthodox as well, yeah. Catholic, Orthodox, and they have the this. churches are all built the uh, same way. Oh my God. What do you have here? The singers, probably. Yes, you or remember? the announcement, babe, you know? The mm. guy who does the announcement, or usually. The, the singers, maybe those who help. Or the, 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 how do you say? The one with the message. Mm -hmm. The preacher. No, no, but the, the main... The singers, I think, they are The there. priest, the main priest, you know, they are staying here. They're there. And then, usually it's those who are helping the... Uh-huh, uh, with singing and... With singing uh, and is in charge of the... Amazing grace. <laughs> exactly. How sweet. But this is so unfortunate that they didn't try to... I saw here, uh, I thought... To restore it. I thought it's... Uh, it's a year, but no, it is J H S. Who knows? See, mm -hmm. I think this is a symbol of Christians. Might be. Who knows? Yeah, and also like a, an altar. Uh, this was the section of the altar, you know. And you this? could. Oh, so you could uh, climb. Mm -hmm. You could climb. Oh. But where is going this? Nowhere. Nowhere. Uh, you used to. Where? You know? No. Yes. No. Oh, oh, maybe you put here the the candles. Mm, who knows? Who knows? I'm yes. just uh, thinking. And then let's see what's here outside. 
on fire. Oh, nothing. Nothing, all the vegetation already. Probably uh, for Baptist. Mm, yes. <laughs> this is uh, grow now. Soon there will be trees here. Mm -hmm. Oh, there's some, oh. you know that symbol, hmm? babe, like uh, CC, but they are turn opposite. Let me show you guys. Oh, like Chanel. Like Chanel. <laughs> <laughs> Chanel was inspired enough, you know? Because we know Chanel was orphan and grew mm -hmm. at the monastery, at the mission, mm -hmm. you know? Mm -hmm. So <laughs> that that's symbols, uh, I think, mean something. But how uh, good it's staying this, uh, it's maintaining yeah. the wall, also this window. Imagine how many people were uh, touching this window. <laughs> wow. Woods, wood, stones and uh, glass. Glass, exactly. That but was the main, and what is uh, the roof made out of? I, they, they changed the roof. Yeah, this is like modern now, yeah. Now, this was definitely not the original. No. But the roof made out of wood as well? Uh, covered, yes. But still, it's, this is like some sort of ceramic uh, tiles, you know? Ceramic. But old ones. Old ceramic. Old, exactly. So... I like that balcony. So it, cute. It's so cute. So, guys, this was our last, as I was saying. Mm -hmm. Our last objective for the day. It's lovely. It's lovely to discover Malacca. It is definitely history. Just, just this saddens me. The buildings, the main buildings where the, all the restaurants are, people saw they are not renovated. Mm -hmm. Because if they would, you know, it will look incredible, the city. Uh, but I also think this uh, UNESCO uh, now uh, a site, you know, is protected and heritage. But you can obviously renovate them, you know, but do better obviously because it's not looking good they are all dirty you know and that it's depressing to walk through the city <laughs> but this you know this could be all take care of renovated all these old churches they will be such an amazing you know a place to visit and attract for, uh, tourists oh my god like we did millions millions of tourists so guys this was our first well, first day of proper exploration of Malacca. Thank you for watching as always. Thank you. Hope you enjoy it. Yes. And see you in the next one. See you. Take care. Take bye. Care. Bye bye.